everyone, it's Lily. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be making these biscuits, some biscuit thingies. Biscuits, I don't know what sort of biscuits they're called, but biscuits, thingies. Sorry about my nose today, so I can't really breathe through my nose that well. So uh, it's going to be Mother's Day very soon, so I need to make something for my mum. And my mum and my mum! My mummy. So here I've got four ounces of butter, soft butter. And then here I've got a quarter of a cup and one tablespoon of icing sugar. And here I've got a pinch of salt. Here I've got one egg yolk, so you need to separate them. Here I've got one teaspoon of vanilla extract, vanilla essence, and then I've got one tablespoon of double cream here, two tablespoons of cornstarch, and then one cup of cake flour, so flour basically. Okay, we're going to now start mixing things together. Have you got your spatula ready? Because it's now time to do some mixing. So you first put the one quarter, a quarter of a cup and one tablespoon of icing sugar in with the pinch of salt and then you mix them a little bit together so like folding them together and it's a bit like playing apart from it's not with your hands and if you do it with your hands it's actually much more easier to mix them together but then it's butter so the butter can easily melt in my hands and I don't want that to happen so I'm just trying to mix it together with the spatula And then we're going to put the yolk in and we're then going to switch to an, an electric whisk mixer, whisk thingy, spatula thingy, thingy. <laughs> I've put my egg yolk in now and so you just need to mix it well together. As you can see, I have basically already mixed it. And then we're going to now put the cream in, the one tablespoon of cream. Carefully because it's full. Yay, I did it. And the vanilla extract. And that was much more easy. And then we mix them together. Like this. It should turn out a bit fluffy like this. I don't mean the fluffy as in like a fluffy as a teddy. We don't need it like that. We just want it like this fluffy. So I've got my cake flour, my flour and my my cornstarch mixed together here and I'm going to put them in so like for the dry ingredients. So we mix the flour in with the other ingredients that we have mixed in. And then after this, I'm going to do some piping over there um, to make the biscuits to eat on Mother's Day. So just mixing um, all the ingredients together and... And now we're going to do our piping. Okay, so now let's start piping. I'm a learner with piping, so I don't know if my piping is very good. <laughs> Before piping, guess what we need? We need a piping bag and the piping thingy magic that you put in the piping bag. And then we also need the tray, a tray. 
I've put some oil down on the tray to help this paper to stick down onto the tray. It's not any sort of paper, as you can see, it's the brown paper. It's grease fr free, grease free, sorry, grease free paper that you put on the trays for cooking. So it's co cooking paper, basically. So I'm going to fill the piping baggy thingy, the piping bag, with the thing that looks like dough. Remember, I'm not good at piping. Please don't laugh at me if I get something wrong. Because I am horrible at piping. I really, I do not know how to do piping. Okay, my mum has done these two to try and teach me how to do some piping, so I'm going to have a go, and as I said, please don't laugh at me. Okay, so you twirl it around, and you don't push it till it's actually coming out, and this is actually quite hard. Uh, and it's hard to push it as well. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, we're making quite big biscuits. Oh god, this is so not good, I don't think I'm going. Okay, I think I, this is the end of it. So then, I've got a blob at the end. I'm going to ask my mum to do the rest of them because I am horrible at it. Mummy, where are you? Please help me. My mum says I can do it, so I'm going to try and do another one. Yeah, it's going out quite well. Uh, uh. I'm just doing this for my mum, otherwise I really wouldn't be doing this. I'm just doing this for, mom, for my mum because of all the hard work she's been doing for me. Press it down and make it up. Oh, I did it! Look at what I did! I did it! <laughs> That's the one I did, which is horrible. I don't like that one. I don't like it. I, it's horrible. I don't like it. Okay, these are the ones I have done with my mummy because I am horrible at it. Well, with this one I am very horrible. So I'm now going to put it in the oven and cook it for 15, about 15 minutes in the oven. And then I'm going to make a cup of tea for my mummy and give it to her. This is on Valentine's Day. You can keep these for a week because they do have sugar in them. I didn't fake it in the right way for me to put it in this. You might be worried, like the paper could set on fire. But as I said at the be in the beginning, the paper is cooking paper, so you can put it in the oven to cook it. It's Mother's Day, not Valentine's Day, and if you give these to your mum on Mother's Day with a cup of nice chai tea, chai tea. Then she'll love you forever and ever and ever and ever! Right, I'm going to get these out. Let's see how they look like. Wow, look at these. So good. We're not going to put it on the plastic because the plastic can melt. Right, these are the biscuits that I have got out some big ones and some small ones and i've even made a cup of tea for my mummy here and i've even got a cup that says mother and it even has a saucer to go with it that also says mother which is good for mother's day so i'm going to show you how i present this to my mummy with the two biscuits on the saucer here and then I'm going to take it to my mummy. I hope she's going to enjoy my biscuits and the tea that I have made her. And I hope you have enjoyed making biscuits with me and watching my video. So please remember to subscribe and to hit the like button, especially if you're new. Bye, I'll see you in my next video.